thank you so much for coming today. I'm very excited about these small books that you brought us. What can you tell me about them? How did you come to bring them up? They were passed down to my best friend from her mother, and I think they were purchased in Europe. And uh, really, I, that's about what I know. What you know about them? Well, I can tell you they're, they're very handsome, but there are a lot of these books that we see today that are purely decorative. And I, I, I actually, when you first brought them, I sort of thought this I can talk about these because they were the sort of thing that a grander family would have had as sort of a sign of status in their house. They're beautifully bound in leather, Moroccan leather with gold embossing. The insides of them have, some of them have this marbleized Italian paper. Um, they're very much a status symbol. But in addition to that, three of them have something that's very special about them. And that is that when they were bound, this gold binding, I have to get it so it's just right. Oh, that's beautiful. Became a scene. And this particular one is by, it's the works of Henry Mackenzie. So this is a scene of Scotland. In fact, in Edinburgh, if you can see that. So it's a painting on the gilded edge of the book, and it was done at the time of the binding. Usually these little paintings, these little scenes, are not signed because the painters were basically employees of the bindery. Here's another one. Let me look and see what this book is. This book was in Latin, and the scene that we have is of the city of Rotterdam, which is really incredible. This is an 18th century book. Again, beautifully bound, beautifully lined interior. Um, the, they have a book label in them all that says Edna Pierce. Does that ring a bell to you? No. That could have been an early owner. Wonderful, wonderful book plates on the inside. This last one I'm going to show you is actually a calendar, and it has the royal calendar, if you will, and it has a wonderful image. Oh, that is so pretty. Of the London Bridge at that period, which was 1804. So we looked up these individually. The only one that doesn't have the gold binding is this one, which was an American published book, published in Boston in the early 19th century. Uh, it would have been much enhanced had, the, had it had the four-edge binding on it. At any rate, two of these we looked up that were in the neighborhood of 200 to 250. Another one, this one around 100. Um, it would depend on how you would sell these. It, I would say as a group, I would estimate them between eight and $1,200. Uh, individually, you may get as much as 250 for the four, four edge binding ones. Okay. But it's, it's just a great thing to have. And if I were your friend, I would definitely mark them because it would be very easy, as I almost did, to overlook that binding. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yes. Thanks Thank so you. much for bringing them in. Thank you. Mm -hmm.